Uh, I've been doing this class uh, for this month, it's actually two years teaching in the International Taekwondo Federation. Uh, we've been here since January at this location. Uh, always accepting new students. We, um, we are part of the International Taekwondo Original. We are a break off of the International Taekwondo Federation under Grandmaster Leonard Kirschbaum. Uh, our home school is, is in Nicholasville. This art in particular tries, uh, we are sort of a mix. I mean, you can have physical limitations and still do the art. Many styles, special styles I've been in before, if you had any kind of disability, slightly, uh, well, it was a limp or they would not make an exception for you. And to me, that's kind of sad. But in here, we do really well with all mixes, all, whether you can stand straight or something. Whether you can kick three foot high or ten foot high. And that's what we are actually about. First of all, I came to watch my granddaughter. She was in it first and uh, came in to watch her and Grandmaster came in and he says, she uh, asked who I was and Tom told him who I was and he said she needs to join us. So that week, next week I joined and been doing it for almost two years now. and. I enjoy it. I'm learning quite a bit. And now I've got two of my granddaughters in it. I've got a 21-year-old and a 12-year-old. You learn a lot when you're doing this. You learn how to protect yourself. You learn how to do weapons. We have all different types of weapons. We can do bow staff, nunchucks, uh, size, katanas. Come on out and join us and you'll have a good time. I basically watched my dad all of his life do other martial arts and I loved it and I always thought it was really cool because I've always had a fond for Batman and he knows a lot of martial arts and he's an expert in martial artists and I always thought that was really cool and how to defend yourself in combat but to not misuse it and to use it for only self-defense because this is what every single martial arts is represent for not to harm people just because you want to do it. It's to be able to, if someday you are feeling threatened and that you feel harmed, you can defend yourself. It feels like a family almost because on the back of our uniform it is a tree and that tree represents the life and foundation of this martial arts and with that takes family and friends and you I don't see how anyone could do it without Tom or Clarissa or Karen Michelle or dad or Jasmine because they're all they all take part in something and we will be as a family and that we will keep this foundation going.